641 by KL Adams. Chapter 1. Keep serving, keep learning, keep loving. For me, I think it really breaks down to having a relationship with God. God is a real being, not a human being, but a patent personality throughout the whole universe. I believe God has given each of us an adulterated fragment of his spirituality. So a pure fragment of God resides in me and you and every other normal-minded person on the face of the earth. Anyone who is capable of making a moral decision has that ingrown spirit within him or her. So the secret is seeking leadership and guidance from that ingrown spirit and also to recognize that God dwells within each and every one of us. The fact that he dwells in us makes us all a son or a daughter of God, they're all our brothers and sisters on this planet. So we should act accordingly and try to be of service to our fellow brothers and sisters if we can, while at the same time trusting God, just like a child would trust his or her parents and that's the most important thing in life. I trust God because I've read old and new scriptures and have experienced a lot of godly things throughout my lifetime. I'll tell you about a fascinating book that has been an incredible godsend to me, just in terms of a source for uplifting information about the nature of God and our relationship with Him. It claims to be written by angels and other non-human beings and it goes through the whole layout of the universe. It talks about paradise, all the way out to our corner of the universe, in which we live in. It states that we live in an evolutionary universe, and believe it or not, God didn't directly create it, if He had created it alone it would have been a perfect universe. It's an evolutionary planet and we are evolving to perfection slowly. Perfection for us humans is part of God's plan, so we have an incredible future ahead of us, for the opportunity of service and learning. Service to our fellow brothers and sisters and learning the word of God, so you just have to keep serving, keep learning and keep loving. Stay tuned for chapter 2.